What's going on guys? So, can you think of anything more urban and street than a Mafia wheelie bike? There isn't nothing, is there, until now, because look what I've built. I don't think you can get much urban and cool than a triple black Mafia Bomber 10 speed, a thousand watt e-bike. Freshly built last night, I've only been out on it for three miles and I can say it's one of the smoothest coolest bikes that I've built so far. The motor on it is so so quiet that you can barely hear it. I don't know if it's a different kind of motor on this. I've not seen this style of motor before. This is a 750 watt stroke 1000 watt max output e-bike motor. Check them tyres out. How cool are those tyres? Really comfortable saddle. Got the uh, Got the full LED screen. Look at that, only three miles on the clock. I'm going to take it out for another quick run. Well, it looks like it's about to rain. It is raining. Oh well. Let's take her out for a quick blast anyway. Oh yeah. The other thing this thing's, this bike's got that I love. Twist throttle. That is so cool. That is so nice, so much nicer than the fun for all. I love that. This bike's just like the ultimate urban beach street cruiser. I absolutely love it. I kind of want to keep it, but I'm going to put it up for sale. Oh my god, look at the weather. Let's see if we can outrun the rain. Oh, hail. Ouch, hail. Such a perfect little bike for just like cruising around town. Another cool thing about this bike is you can uh, the twist throttle is so much easier to hold a coffee and ride at the same time. I need to get myself one of them coffee cup holders you can get for your bike. So much better than being stuck in a car. See you later. Oh, 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 nearly died. Let's go to the seaside. Let's go for it. We're at the seaside, Leon C. 29, are we going to push 30 downhill? Yes. As you can see, even going at this speed, I'm, I've made it to the seafront quicker than I would in my car. It's ideal for your little uh, urban street cruiser. Andy, can't wait for the summer, mate. Still got four bars of battery. <laughs> right, this is a big test for the bike. It's dropped about six volts since fully charged. Now I'm going to try and get up this. This is this is a horrible, horrible hill to have to cycle up. You see people like it's one of them hills you go past people in a car and you feel sorry for them cycling. So. I'm probably going to start pedalling, I'm not pedalling at all at the moment, I'm going to start pedalling in a bit. But I'm going to measure how good this bike is by how knackered I feel by the top. Or how much effort I've got to put in. Uh, still going too fast to even pedal at the moment. What a nightmare. The camera cut out and I didn't have any more footage, so... <laughs> 
I mean, it was pretty much just the end of the hill test and the uh, outro, which I did on the bike. So uh, the bike got up the hill, no problems at all. It's quite a long hill, that if anyone knows it, which was good because I accidentally knocked the level assist from five down to four, and it still got up the hill with no no issues. So that's that's good. It's good quality bit of kit. I can't get over how silent the hub motor is. The controller's built into the uh, battery holder, so that's nice and compact and tidy. When I tested the bike, I still had a couple of bits to do. I had to finish the um, battery holder mount. So the cable ties are off the battery now. Torque arms fitted to it. It's, it's all done, ready to go, fully tested. It's a really good bike. So um, just the, the tyres are super cool on it. Like it's got motorcycle style tyres, twist grip. Like the posture for riding, it's different to a normal mountain bike as well. It's a lot more laid back and like upright. You're not like leaning over like on a mountain bike. You just kind of feels more like an actual beach cruise, you know, to ride. It does feel pretty laid back and cool. It's perfect with like zipping around town and just uh, kind of posing. It looks looks really good in all black. Really nice bike, so yeah. If anyone's interested in buying that bike, I'm going to leave the link in the description. Catch you guys in another video soon. Take it easy.